Hello and welcome to a new topic what is cognition the word cognition is believed to have come from two latin words the first one is cognitio and the second one is cognito and both of them have the same meaning that is to say get to know so this is the literal interpretation of the word cognition now we try to discuss some more ideas about the word in fact the word cognition started being used from late middle english which has come from the latin origin and cognitive which is the adjective form of the word cognition and of course related to cognition uh, we can say for example cognitive skills we can say cognitive learning we can say cognitive theory and so on so in a number of ways we can use the term particularly adjective cognitive now let's talk about the word cognition cognition and of course it's noun it refers to mental action where your mind is in action where you apply your mind you think about something not only you think about something in fact you think deeply about something in other words we can say cognition is the process of acquiring knowledge and understanding through through what through thought so of course we apply our mind and through the application of our mind we acquire knowledge and understand when you are thoughtful you gain knowledge when you are thoughtless careless you don't apply your mind you don't apply your thought of course you cannot get or acquire knowledge develop understand then through experience so knowledge not only comes from thought or from reading books knowledge also comes from experiences of life then we have and the senses and knowledge also comes from the senses like you try to distinguish whether it is cool whether it is warm whether it is dark whether there is light all knowledge having gained through thought experience and the senses belong to the part of cognition briefly we can say cognition refers to the input and storage of information and how that information or knowledge is then used to guide our thought and behavior when we say input and storage of information in other words it is the same as acquiring knowledge and understanding of something and then once you acquire knowledge let that knowledge guide you to improve your way of thinking and behavior result from the process of cognition leads to the perception it develops our perception when you have good understanding of something when you have acquired good knowledge about something it develops your perception your outlook towards something it also improves your ability of sensation you understand it in a much better way you grasp it in a much better way idea it develops your idea it helps you think in a different direction and intuition it also develops your intuition intuition is something that happens spontaneously without having any influence of logic and reason or in other words when you have acquired knowledge better understanding of something then this helps you develop all these things and you must know that cognition is an important not only important in fact the central part of learning process in this brief lesson i hope you understand the concept thank you and goodbye